I'm gonna get a quick video here showing the difference between the standard uh, Z bar linkage system and John Deere's uh, power level system is what they call it. Everybody's familiar with this system, but you've got your Z-bar linkage, you've got your cylinder on top. The bars hinged here in the center uh, from the boom arms, and then goes down to there, and that linkage runs out to your bucket. Um, go over here and show you the power level system. This one's completely different. Um, the cylinders on the bottom on this one. You got your cylinder, you got your linkage here. It goes up and then uh, bar down to curl the bucket. This bar here is pinned down to the boom. Basically to keep this from just flopping up and down. Um, then in the center of this linkage, they've got a yoke that goes back and pins the frame. Uh, the advantage to this linkage system is uh, greatly increases your breakout force because your uh, your cylinders on the bottom pushing out against this bar which is pulling from up there instead of on the boom so if you're lifting your bucket and curling at the same time you're actually got an extra cylinder pushing your bucket up as you're rolling it back so you have a lot more breakout force um, than your standard Z-bar linkage because if you're trying to lift your boom into your pile or your bank with this system and you try and curl it, your cylinder's pushing the boom back down instead of pushing it upward so you're actually counteracting your boom breakout force with the bucket curl on a Z-bar system. So. This is the first one of these we've had. It's a pretty good loader. Um, it's got a deer factory quick attach or a quick coupler on it. The things I like about it is it's got these replaceable pins. So if they start to get worn and sloppy, you can just replace the pin and instead of having to spend a whole day welding, welding up your hook bar and the uh, inside of your hook on your bucket to get the slop out of them. This power level boom seems to, uh, you know, to me, it seems like it lifts a little bit higher than a standard Z bar linkage booms do. The boom sticks out a little farther away from the machine. Seems like maybe the bucket has a little bit more travel and it also rolls back farther and dumps a little bit farther. So, I think it's a pretty good system. They look heavy as hell much more than a z-bar system but sure looks like it make the front end of the loader a little heavier and it does have a slightly smaller bucket than our, uh, than our tray does with the z-bar system on it. 